annual conference has been one of my professional dreams. I've always wanted to come here because I really admire the work that your Cleo does. But it has always been too difficult or too expensive to come. And this year I just thought, okay, if not now, then when? And I've decided to do the crowdfunding. And I got crowdfunding in like 12 hours. <laughs> it was amazing. It's my little page. It's called uh, Teacher Antanas, where I post things about history teaching. And this is the original post from January. It's called Send Me to Learn. I mentioned EuroCleo. What is it? What's the conference about this year? And why do you need support? And that is simply ask for money. Then I shut my computer down. I was too afraid to watch what happens. <laughs> And of course, I checked my smartphone and I uh, saw money coming to my bank account. And early in the morning, I had to tell people, okay, thank you so much, that's enough. <laughs> But the money kept flowing <laughs> for the rest of the day. I came because I'm generally an um, internationally minded teacher and I could not close myself to the national narratives or the national history teaching tradition. It's very good to meet uh, teachers all over Europe and share ideas and our experiences and our struggles in history teaching. We share a lot of the same ideas in, in, in different European countries. And the workshops and the content lectures are really professional. It's great that people asking for money not only when they need help to survive, but uh, when they want to grow. I had a genuine interest in learning and uh, bringing new ideas uh, to Lithuania and, uh, well, people believed in it. In different European countries, history education is becoming like second-class subject with uh, less hours uh, for history teaching. And then we see the big things going on in our societies and we have problems that may be tackled using history education because history education is also connected to democracy and how we evolve the societies. If teachers share the same needs for international experience, they should come next year.